we all know our moon takes 28 days to complete one revolution around the earth when the moon is between the sun and the earth we get a new moon day and when the earth is between the sun and the moon we get full moon day have you ever stopped and wondered why every new moon day is not a solar eclipse and every full moon day is not a lunar eclipse to find the answer for this question we must first understand what is an eclipse see an eclipse occurs when one celestial body such as a moon or any planet moves into the shadow of another celestial body here the light coming from one celestial body is blocked by another celestial body see the pictures here during an eclipse two shadows are cast the first is called the umbra and this shadow gets smaller as it goes away from the sun it is the dark center of the eclipse shadow the second shadow is called penumbra the penumbra gets larger as it goes away from the sun first let us see what is a solar eclipse see a solar eclipse occurs when part or all of the sun is blocked out by the moon as viewed from earth see this image here this is how solar eclipse occurs here you can see the moon is blocking the sun's ray from reaching the earth see there are three types of solar eclipse now let us see the types first is the total solar eclipse see this occurs when the entire sun is blocked by moon due to the alignment of sun earth and moon then there is the partial solar eclipse this occurs when only part of the sun is blocked by the moon when it crosses the path of the light of sun and to moon finally there is the annular solar eclipse see the annular solar eclipse occurs when the moon is at its farthest point in its elliptical path of orbit around the earth and due to this it is only capable of blocking out part of the sun thus leaving the periphery of the sun visible you can see this image here to understand about the annular solar eclipse these are the types of solar eclipse now let us see about the lunar eclipse a lunar eclipse occurs when part or all of the moon is blocked out by the earth note the difference here as we saw earlier during solar eclipse moon is blocking light from the sun and to earth and during lunar eclipse the earth blocks the light from the sun from reaching the moon having seen this now let us see the types of lunar eclipse firstly there is the total lunar eclipse see it occurs when the entire moon is in the earth's darkest shadow what is the earth's darkest shadow as we saw earlier it is the umbral shadow then there is the partial lunar eclipse it occurs when the sun earth and moon aren't exactly aligned so only part of the moon passes into earth's umbral shadow finally there is the penumbral lunar eclipse here also it occurs when the sun earth and moon are not fully aligned know that the moon in case of penumbral lunar eclipse passes through only the penumbral shadow of the earth and does not pass through the darkest part of its shadow that is the umbra that's all regarding lunar eclipse and solar eclipse finally before concluding let us see why the solar and the lunar eclipse is not happening every month see as we all know the earth revolves around the sun in a elliptical path completing one revolution in about 365 days the plane in which the earth moves around the sun is known as the ecliptic at the same time the moon also revolves around the earth which is also a near elliptical path and the moon takes 28 days to complete one revolution around the earth the fact here is that these two planes of earth and moon are inclined to each other at an angle see for the solar eclipse to occur the sun the moon and the earth must not only fall in the same straight line but these three bodies should be in the same straight plane and this occurs only during the eclipse although the sun moon and the earth comes in a single line every two weeks eclipses does not happen every month because as we saw earlier the earth's orbit around the sun is not in the same plane as the moon's orbit around the earth so this is why we are not witnessing solar and lunar eclipse every month 
to know more about such interesting phenomenon follow the daily hindi news analysis by shankar as academy and subscribe to shankar as academy's youtube channel thank you